In November, I fished three times. Once on the Dolores, which you guys saw in my previous video, so I won't be showing much of that footage here. But, I will put a link in the description section of this video so you can watch it. As you can see, I did catch quite a few fish though, and it was a great trip on the Dolores. But, on this video I will be showing you my fishing of the San Juan River, and also a small lake called Haviland Lake, with my kid. On the San Juan River, I was testing out a new annelid pattern that I have designed. I started out here at Texas Hole, but there were a lot of small little fish. I could not get down deep enough to the larger fish, so I decided to move. At this next spot, I was also catching a lot of small fish. Then I came to this spot, where I was catching some smaller ones, however I saw a larger one deep in the run, so I continued to fish it. Hey, and I did hook up with them. He was a feisty one though, and tough to get in the net. But finally I was able to do so. Hey, a decent 15 to 16 inch rainbow. After that, I decided to move to one of my favorite spots in the braids. This little cove always holds some decent fish. And sure enough, I hooked into a large one. I was fishing a 10 foot 3 weight, so I couldn't really put much pressure on him. I fought him for a little while, but I cut most of the fight due to the length of the video. Hey, a really nice 18 to 19 inch rainbow. And they were really fat today. So I moved to another run, and I ended up hooking up with an even larger rainbow. I cut this video down a bit also because it was a 7 minute fight. A really nice 20 inch trout. So I ended up moving up to Big Rock Hole on the back side of the braids. And I hooked up with a fish, but he wasn't too large, only about 16 inches.
Then, I hooked up with something that kicked my butt. I must have tail hooked him or something due to how fast he ran out of there. I could not get much pressure on him and finally he wrapped around a rock deep in that run. But boy, he was a powerful fish. No. All right guys, so Eli and me are gonna go fish and we're gonna go up to that little lake called Haviland Lake. And first we gotta run to uh, Walmart and grab some bait because Eli doesn't know how to cast a fly rod yet. Obviously he's only four. So what are we going to do, Eli? Go fishing. We're going to go fishing. So, this is the first time he's ever gone, and first time he's actually caught a fish. He's got a little a little rod that I've given him that he's done a lot of practice with casting with. So, this is the first time I'm taking him. He's already four, so he's finally hitting that age that I feel comfortable taking him out with sharp objects like hooks. So, anyway, let's see how this goes. You've got a fish, bud. Uh-huh. Hey, sorry for the bad camera work. I was filming with my phone in hand and trying to net the fish at the same time. Reel it in, reel it in. Oh, he's big. Good job. Reel it in. Reel it in. Woo! I was really proud of him. He was reeling like a pro. He was pulling the rod backwards, then reeling down on the fish. I got one. Look at that, bud. That's a big one, too. Uh -huh. I got it. You got it. Uh -huh. Woo! <laughs> okay, hold on. All right, smile. Smile. You got a big fish. Well, guys, that was my fishing adventures in November. Not a whole lot of action. But we are in the winter time. Overall though, this was probably one of my most memorable months fishing, due to the fact that my kid caught a fish for his first time. Also, I was really happy by the way my new fly performed. It seemed to catch quite a few large fish. So I'll have to tie that up on video for you guys at one point, and I'm hoping to have these carried in the fly shop that I work at soon. If you guys ever stop and floating fish, just ask for that new anilid pattern designed by McFly. Hey, thanks for watching, everyone. Also, keep in mind my new shirts are now available for purchase. These are pretty good prices for a really high-end fishing shirt. Also, your purchase will help support this channel. I will see you in the next video. Now you go catch some fish.